to the Fantasy Footballers Podcast. I'm going to talk about a, lot, a little laxative here. Oh, what? Well, the restraints of the beehole have been <laughs> loosed. Okay. There was this is even- what we're going with? Are you just trying? Like, you're just poking me with your picks mm. today. So as a hand, as a hand, <laughs> for w- <laughs> but no, it was just a fish slap to the face for all of us, <laughs> which nobody likes. You ever been slapped by a fish? No, because we all were yesterday. All right, now Brooks, do we do we have an actual drop for this segment? Nope. Thanks, man. Cool. I didn't even know we were doing this, but it's amazing. Look, do you want to you want to drop? We can do a live drop. Oh, I want to hear it. That For means, sure. No, it just means you're beatboxing, Jason. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> Come here, Steve. <laughs> that last James White reception was... Where nobody played defense? Was hilarious. <laughs> yes. The Texans are like, Come on, dude. The game is over. What are you doing, James? James, what are you doing? Stop. For fantasy! <laughs> <laughs> He's just running, screaming that down the field. Jay Gruden Peterson. expects big things from Josh Doxson this year, Jason. <laughs> Just that's why this they, year. That's why they declined his fifth-year option. Right. You always expect huge things from those players. You're like, not on my team. Not Nothing lights a fire under a dude's butt like no contract. Am we I right? told Brooks. We said, we're not going to keep you next year. Mm-hmm. But we expect big things oh, this he's gonna, year. He's going to work so much this harder This year now. is – Brooks, you're, you've been putting in the extra man hours. Yeah. So they're they're the <laughs> Thank you. They're Thank the, you. <laughs> just coming in with that fire, bro. You can tell the effort level is way up there. Same argument here. I love Sam Darnold. I lo- I've loved what I've seen this season. I agree that he's a better quarterback, but because fantasy scoring is so <clears throat> in the favor of rushing for quarterbacks, Mitch Trubisky is a great runner. Now, are you drinking a water or a yoo-hoo right now, Jason? I am drinking a water. Okay. I thought you pulled a yoo-hoo out. I I did. But I didn't want it to give me, you know, the the frog throat. I, but I, I've got it already, so it doesn't, it doesn't matter. really make a difference. And nothing makes a difference. I should just down a bunch of whole milk before the show. <laughs> oh, please no. Warm whole milk, because Ooh. maybe, maybe somehow that would help. The fact that Devonte Parker resigned, I mean, that was shocking because the Dolphins. Hated Devonte Parker. They their, wouldn't let him play. Their beat writer play. said he was gone, and and yeah, everyone said he's gone. And then you realize it's because of the butthole. Adam <laughs> Gaze was the one who didn't like. I mean, Adam Gaze one hundred percent was the phrase. problem with with Devonte Parker. The outside <laughs> of my body is here. The shell that you have come to know. As Jason Moore is still on the show. Jason Moore is no more? The inside is hollow. I am an M&M with no chocolate. So you're like the uh, the Easter chocolate bunnies. Oh, with the... Where, where it's, you're like, oh, that's ex- a whole bunch of chocolate. Oh, Except they serve a purpose. Mm. Oh, my gosh. They can be delicious and a tasty <laughs> treat. While I have no reason. This. To be here. <laughs> Why don't you fill people in? Yeah, not every fill fill them in. Well, you hey can't oh. fill me in. No, 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 fill them. Fill, fill a river. Them. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> a river of tears. Kay. Rivers is driving down the field. Rivers needs to essentially drive down the field for Jason to win, and he does. And he does. And I won. And Jason was up by half a point until one more. One more interception. I believe that is seven interceptions in the last two games. I have had all of them. (laughs) Um, But it took each one to put me where I'm at right now. Let's start with Josh Allen because he's the most interesting fantasy storyline. Talking about Josh Stallion. Oh, Oh my gosh. Josh Stallion. (laughs) Excellent. I feel really (laughs) – I'm in off-season form, Brooks. That's wrong. I got to have that ready for you. No, you did have it ready for me. Mm. Uh, Brooks, you, you don't need to hold his hand. The man needs to know about Josh Stallion. He's going to learn some, how to swim on his own. At some point, I need to hand this off to Brooks. That's Oh, Brooks I hosting mean, the show? No, not the – stop. Oh. Don't don't be ridiculous. Brooks Jason, with the drops. We almost, we almost did it, Jason. Oh, I just, <laughs> Soon. <laughs> yeah. All right. No. All right. Here comes Brooks. No, Let's no, see no. how it goes. Let's <laughs> see nope. how it goes. Nope. You've got Zach Taylor coming in. 
as the new head coach from the Sean McVay breathed on him <laughs> tree. <laughs> and so you've got Mixon out there saying he's preparing. He needs to make a cologne. <laughs> oh, oh, totally. I would buy it. I would I would 100% buy it. The offensive I would invest. spritz. <laughs> it's, oh, my yeah. gosh. The, the toilet, Sean McVay. <laughs> yeah, I could just see somebody buy in McVay. Detroit. Is spraying the heck out of Matt Patricia. <laughs> they put it up they in the prop plane. <laughs> <turn. laughs> Can we get the aerosol version? Did you just say a crop plane? Uh, yeah, a prop plane. They're, they're hitting the... the crops. Oh, my goodness. We're yeah. going to supercharge the city with the scent of McVeigh. McVeigh but. by Calvin Klein. <laughs> Yes. Like you can get mad at me for like opposing you, but you know what's coming when you pick guys that are like awesome. <laughs> no, what was the adjective you were using? That Great? Have, that that are wild cards. I, I got I got disconnected because I was now picturing a fish actually slapping someone, not Little somebody slapping. Because you said, "Have you ever been slapped by a fish?" Uh, Which made me think that the fish had done the slapping. That would be fine. Um, I've never been slapped by a fish. I've never been slapped with a fish. It's mm. one of the things I take great pride in. I've led my life in a way where that has not happened yet. Y you do not soon forget. You were hitting a drop for a king. I'm going to talk about the lizard king as <laughs> the, the lizard king, Sammy Watkins himself. Are you going to mean Jim Morrison, Jason? I was going to bring that up the other day. I don't even know if Jason knows what no, reference course. he's making. Wait, are you telling me that Jim Morrison is known as the lizard king? Yes. Well, does he have I'll a be. does he have a song called the Lizard King? I'm yes. just searching for drops here. I mean, if <laughs> well, you could say people are strange. When you're a stranger, I'm just proud that I knew that. My second bus pick again. It's an ADP adjustment. It's a belief adjustment. It's it's a maybe a stifling of the ADP rise. It's Carry On Johnson. Boo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You should be. I know what that means to our relationship. I know what that means to your propensity to share your White Castle with me. Mm -hmm. which Not going to happen. No nothing. sliders for you. But this, I want. This is actually great news. <laughs> <laughs> he is a s complete. He is sound asleep. This is a Rip Van Winkle levels of sleeping. That's a literature <laughs> reference for people in the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta bust the boo. I got booed. Boo literature. <laughs> boo reading. <laughs> Adam Gase, his first message to the Jets, he came there to dethrone the Patriots. So there you go. Wasn't he already <laughs> in the division with the Patriots <laughs> last year? Now that's funny. <laughs> he came there to so do what, what he came there to do before. Jason, what was your mission even, last year? Not just last year. Yes, yeah. the last several years. <laughs> <laughs> what did he come to Miami to do? They just they took anything you know about statistical analysis, they wadded it up, they wiped their rear ends with it, <laughs> and they threw it in the garbage. They didn't just throw it away; they used it as a wipe. Absolutely, <laughs> and then they Look. didn't flush it. No, they no, no. It, I recommend if you well, use you can't it for flush a, the garbage. But Jason. they threw it in the garbage. Whatever didn't you, <laughs> you use for a wipe needs to be flushed, not <laughs> put just, in the garbage can. That's just, just a rule of life. <laughs> you just you threw it in the trash. Like, I told you they were being rude. Sammy Watkins. Okay, say whatever you want about the Lizard King, but he's he's <laughs> he's the king now. He he's ain't the man. Playing. He <laughs> took over the uh, the top seat. Call Jason Stephen A. Smith. Entered his oh, entered no, his cocoon. On. I'm Edit talking that about out. you. Edit his... that out. That's <laughs> disgusting. Steven. Shamu is fine. <laughs> you could call me Shamu. I'm fine with that. I've got a few extra lbs. You call me Stephen A. Smith. Oh, bad takes. Goodness. <laughs> Why, Mike, don't you trade with me? Why won't you trade with me? What are you talking me? about? We made a Why trade. Why don't you trade with me more? Well, because I know what you tried to do in trades, which is not just improve uh, your team. It's make mine worse. Mike, at the exact Mike, I want time. the best for you. Look at a team and make sure it could improve that team. Ideally, your Hogwash. trade your trade helps both <laughs> yeah. teams. That's not what Andy does. Really. It's like telemarketing. Like, everyone, who who likes a telemarketer? Who answers? Lit literally nobody. And Which is why I don't like being associated with them. Well, that's too bad because <laughs> this, this, is your, this is your trade approach because it just takes one. Mm -hmm. It takes one person to pick up the phone and go, well, maybe uh, maybe that is interesting. Maybe the FBI is after me. I would love a free vacation. 
I, I, I look for a nibble. They uh, canceled my social security card. I'm standing on the, the beach of the lake with eight or nine fishing poles in my hand. I'm waiting for a nibble on one of them so then I can start the conversation. But I, uh, yeah, I don't like the analogy <laughs> <laughs> whatsoever. But Jason. He's not a hat person. And then, like, this is not meant to be an insult because it's just you put a hat on him. It's just a fact. You look, you look like a strange yes. person. And it doesn't matter the type, the type of hat. It's just all hats. It, give me that crisp bill. Fit yeah, in. You know what he is? He's a snapback. He's a fedora guy. Oh, oh no! I have not yet tried <laughs> oh. the fedora. Oh, that's probably it. That's what you've been missing. Maybe Please. a bowler. Uh, <laughs> we did a top hat. You're a top hat kind of guy. That's like Sammy Watkins. Yeah, it kind of is like Sammy Watkins. You're right. <laughs> and weird, you don't like Sammy Watkins. Uh, it's funny. I you don't. think we know who he is at this no, point? No, because we know who we Cooper didn't is. know who he was. So we read some of his tweets. Right. Then we found out, <laughs> then he's we a lizard figured out he was a lizard person. But let's digress. Flight Someone over rips here. their skin off in the crowd. We do exist. <laughs> <laughs> I would be back on the Sammy Watkins if that happened. As the great philosopher J.G. Wentworth says. Oh, gosh. It's my money and I want it now. <laughs> Well, Eric Ebron is also on the mend mm? from a groin injury. I feel like I missed this in the world. Everybody did. I, I, mean, I This is the first I've heard of it. And I, when I saw beat reporters talking about it, they... You guys don't subscribe to the groin index? The newsletter? <laughs> mm. It was all over that. Man. What's the... What's I the, actually what's don't recommend... I don't, I don't... For, the, for the groin index. <laughs> I don't recommend subscribing <laughs> to that. I really don't. The groin index. You know, you think you want it, and then you don't. Um, Groinindex.com. <laughs> don't you don't registering do it. it? Please don't. Uh, if not, then... <laughs> who's, mean, the, who's the backup, Jay? I believe it is pronounced David Blow. I, we don't, I don't know for sure. Yeah. Is that how you would sp uh, pronounce that, Mike? B L O U G H. Uh, I would not blah blah. <laughs> Either way, it's gonna <laughs> blow. They maybe need more emphasis on the G's. Blauch. Yeah. Oh, oh it's German. Yes. Yeah. David the Blauch. God bless you. <laughs> Ooh, it is I. Here's the thing. David Blauch. <laughs> <laughs> now presenting <laughs> David Blauch. Oh, 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 oh. I think now I am from Transylvania. <laughs> David the Blauch. Josh Allen yeah, has I've been, been Allen so low in an average draft position. Josh who? Sorry. Oh, Josh, thank Josh you, bro. Stallion. Uh, but I don't have the button here, man. Oh. I wasn't ready for that. Josh Stallion. No, no, no. Keep hold, – hold on. Because he runs, we call him Josh <laughs> Stallion. You get it? What's the nickname for him again? I, Josh. I, <laughs> thanks, Brooks. Our smoothest you drop of all time. And I worry that there's not much talent on the offensive side of the ball, specifically behind the center. And that's my worry. <laughs> Wait. My my worry <laughs> is that the quarterback, offensive coordinator You know the combo, running backs are also behind the center, technically. But when you add them with the quarterback and then Is like that what they call the, the guy that um, shoots the ball out of his butt? Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 The, the center. The guy that, yes, that is what my, your son called me yes. after last night's game because so, I am the guy that shoots the ball out of his butt. Yeah, we got in the car after the game, and, J and my seven-year-old's asking the positions. And uh, I'm the quarterback, and Jason's the guy that shoots the ball out his butt. Yeah. Half back, half crack. Oh. Football butt shooter. So, oh, my gosh. So that's just my my, my I like it. My 10-year-old, my my instead of saying center, he goes, he's very, you know, correcting the seven-year-old. That's the snapper. That's the snapper, oh. Nathan. The, so the I football mean, butt snapper. Yeah, the butt snapper. Yeah. I think... I think I'm going to stick with the guy that shoots the balls out of his butt. Do you remember, Andy? No, oh, no. Last year, we went on tour, and mm. we had this big opening. I don't remember what city it was, and Jason was like, I'm going a, I'm to a land this jump off the stage, <laughs> and it's going to be awesome. And it, then he fell. It was he awesome. Did. He over. jumped off the stage, but he didn't remember that just it was, distance causes you to so, – <laughs> Here's the problem. It was very dark off the uh -huh. stage. Yeah, but and so good where decision. the floor I'm look was so cool. Where the floor was was different than where my brain said the floor was. So, but uh, I still jumped off and I did not Little break wobbly. any legs. Little wobbly. <laughs> Happy.
Happy Halloween from the Fantasy Footballers. We have a special show in store for you, and you don't want to miss it because there are good jokes. At school, when, when someone would right. come down with mono, you don't see him for a month. Exactly. So th this is going to cost him a couple of weeks. Smoke's I expect around. maybe he's back in week five after they're by. I, it, mono feels like an old disease, right? Old being like... Not age, just like right. like it's like it's, it's an old it, fashion. It had its time and it doesn't happen anymore. And and like to me, I hear oh but he's got mono. Can he play through mono? See the reason I'm though, not I, educated. The reason I feel like that you say it feels old because we don't hear about it anymore. The reason is because we're not in high school anymore. The oh, it's like a big thing. Like, yes. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, it's the kissing disease. Yeah. High school's like oh man, don't share got, water bottles, kids. It was like cool to get mono. Oh, because that meant you, you were. Uh, so like, oh, I take it then gonna, neither of you ever. I, I did not get it. No, I never had one. Th that was not a, an indictment on your high school smooching life. Although um, uh, it it works both ways. Hey, bro, I got a cold sore. All right. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's to be proud of. I'm proud like, of that cold sore. Now, TJ Hawkinson, I think we've established, we've received all the feedback, the input, the data necessary, all the possible nicknames for TJ Hawkinson. And what we've actually come up with is, look, we have a two-game sample. For TJ, we have one game in which oh, he was hockey Lee, hockey Lee, <laughs> hockey Lee. One game in which he was hockey Lee. Yeah, but unfortunately, last week we had one game sweaty, not one for seven used, not a good start. No, toss him away like a hawk strap. <laughs> All right. So if he put, like a Gardner Minshew hawk strap. So if he puts up a big game, we've established he's hockey Lee. <laughs> if he if he uh, lays an egg. Unfortunately, he has to bear the name Hawkstrap for the week. So it's the first player with two nicknames. Don't blame us, TJ Hawkinson. It's not our fault. No, the Foot Clan, they came out in droves. We just couldn't choose. So have a good game. Be Hockulies. Delicious touchdown. It's going to be a good one. It's going to be a bad one. Fedora Watch is on. Found one. <laughs> Uh, to all our YouTube <laughs> subscribers out there, I would like to personally issue an apology and know that um, I hate myself as much as you hate me right now while Your you're watching. Your glasses are so fogged, you look like you're wearing a monocle. Yeah. <laughs> With well, the fedora. Here's a little insight, Foot Clan. Right before <laughs> we started this episode... Um, we were we were laughing pretty hard. We were la We just we st we started it like twice, and I just I was laughing too hard. I couldn't stop. It's just one of those days. Um, I think it all started when I looked at the monitors and saw you in a fedora. Yeah, I look like the world's most punchable. What is face it right with now. your head and hats? Why doesn't it work? Why don't they work together? I don't know. Like it doesn't matter if it's a baseball hat. A s I mean, See, I could ruin a looks, Santa cap. This fedora looks small to me, based on your your proportions i don't know are but you it's calling here. me fat <laughs> not, not on purpose but probably a reminder as always follow us on twitter at the ff ballers on instagram instagram.com slash fantasy footballers you okay there jay i am doing great didn't want to duck doing away well. from the mic no on that, that little, was that was right in right there. into the mic um <laughs> is this button not working uh, uh no all right. No, no. Oh, did you think you had pushed the mute button? Yes, I have this. Um, Try it out. Yeah, no, that that's definitely working. Yeah, now. it worked that time. <laughs> okay. So it, you win some, you lose. It some. did not look like you pushed it. <laughs> <laughs> did you uh, guys, you guys hear that? It's great because he didn't realize anything had happened. <laughs> it, even, though, really, even, even though, though you could hear it, he's got he... headphones on. He could totally hear <laughs> the, <laughs> I had, uh, the cough. Like, well, oh, I'm that didn't coughing, work. So, I, of course, I would hear it, but. Yeah, come to think of it, it was rather loud. <laughs> if you want to play like Jason and be a little baby about your tight end. <laughs> oh, my god, <laughs> Brooks, where Give do we go from tips. here? I drove in today. A little Hootie and the Blowfish on the radio and then followed up by Naughty by Nature. Wow. That combination gets you going. Mike, you said well, that. Well, one of those gets you going. <laughs> One of those, Not a Hootie fan. One of those gets me going out the room. You don't like Hootie? You like Hootie? Of course. Can we pull the room? Seriously, Hootie and the Blowfish? Give me a yeah, break. I'm, we got, we got uh, thumbs I'm, up. We got thumbs down. We got three down, one up. You just want to be Mike's friend. Everybody's thumbs down. Oh, Mike's cool. 
Uh, no. Cool people don't like Hootie. No. I, it's a 90s channel, man. It brings you back. Oh, yeah, it brings me back to the time where I was like, ah, crap, Hootie and the Blowfish are on the radio oh, again. Oh, stop it. And then you turn, trying to find the new station. Brooks, what is the Thursday show? I, I don't know. It's not the free agent preview on Thursday, right? Not quite. Next going to be next week, but this Thursday, 10 things to remember. I got I, one for you for next year. Don't wear a fedora? Yeah, that was it. Yeah. Mm. Um, let me write that down. I will be a pantomime today. He will, <laughs> he'll need to be on YouTube to really understand the contributions of Jason Moore today because... Whoa! Look, if you have not tuned into the YouTube, Jason, did you... I know you were a theater major. Theater at a fellow. No, you, that was correct. <laughs> did you take Did you take official pantomime not classes? Not only did I, I have an award for it. <laughs> no, you do not. <laughs> it's actually... It's, it's not you something I'm proud award? of. It's not something I'm proud of. Not something I wished ever would come up on the show, <laughs> but it is a fact. Oh, welcome in. It's football time. Hey, hey, hey. Throwing in a few lyrics for the theme song today. <laughs> Those welcome are actually in. the words. That people don't know this. Well, you did write it, so. People don't know that the fantasy footballer's theme song <laughs> has, it has words. It's called, it's football time. Yeah, That's the name of the song. And that's the, that's it. That's it. You just you fit it in where you can fit it in and then scream, hey. The United States government and Pete Carroll should both just get rid of pennies because <laughs> uh, they, there's, they're, they're not that valuable. I mean, Chris Carson wow. is amazing. <laughs> Mike is trying to tell me not to bring Don't up. do it, man. I, could, oh, I did it again. <laughs> What is what wrong are you with doing? My brain? What are you doing? I don't Why know. are you pushing the button? The Steelers spank the Bengals. The Bengals are 0 4. Here's I, my go ahead, Jay. I'm getting milked. That's that's my takeaway. <laughs> don't now, context. Can here. we just get that quote, Brooks, separately? <laughs> Let's close the show out with some candid thoughts on Phillip Rivers. Okay. He's washed. He's done. He's the best person you can play against. And if I could trade him to my opponent, I would do it every week. All, All right. right. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you for listening to another episode of the Fantasy Footballers Podcast. Join our fantasy football community on jointhefoot.com and follow us on Twitter at the FFBallers.